Hello everyone and you know how we can make something sticky by using Elementor Pro. So let's say if I had an Elementor Pro, I mean I have Elementor Pro but you know there's this option of uh, in motion effects there's option of like sticky which is like top offset, effect offset and all, stay in column or not. So if I do this you could see it just, uh, it is just staying on top like this and if I do like stay in column it just stays in column and then maybe I should make this bigger. So you could see it, it just stays in column, it just stops around here. But again, we don't really need Elementor Pro for this one. Because again, there are more options around here, like to change how it works and stuff. But I'll give you like one simple way to do it in case it's, it's not completely like sticky effect like this, but it does work. And that is very simple to do. So let me just, I guess I'll like, I'll just add this uh, text around here like this and then just add some text editor stuff like this just to showcase some design okay nothing crazy quickly just create something uh, let's let me just you know copy this one and then just go bam 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 let's copy this oops just something to show how this works okay Obviously, just create like a nicer design than the shitty one that I've created. Let's add an image inside on the right side because I want to make the, let's say, image sticky. I'll add, I guess, this much, this image. And right now, I want to make this one sticky. So, obviously, if you had Elementor Pro, you would go into Motion FX, Stop, and then it would be sticky like this. Uh, we can obviously do a stay in column like this, okay? And another thing is, uh, let's say if I had something on top, okay, so I know it's going like very derailed, so I'm just going random stuff. But let's say if this was like around here and I have given it motion effect, something like this, which is uh, top and then not stay in column. So right now you could say it is like this, but if I scroll down, it starts getting sticky. But because it is not set to set in column, it would be on on top of everything. Actually, I don't know how to do this one where it just stays on top of everything. I mean, I know how to do it, um, how to make it like stay on top of everything, but I don't know how to do it in in a way that it, right now nothing is showing. But as soon as we start scrolling around here, it gets sticked like this. Okay, so let's quickly show you the methods. So if you don't have Elementor Pro, usually we are going to, uh, I mean, we are going to use CSS, but there's a way to use like CSS without having Elementor Pro. It kind of increases like a uh, DOM size of the page, but for something like this, like this is or something like small like this, it doesn't really matter. So I'll just add an HTML widget below this one. And here we will type style. Uh, if you have Elementor Pro, you could just use a sticky widget or basically try it. If you want to do the CSS method, you could add it around here. Okay. But let's add it in the style. Let's name this something, something like, I guess like flower. Why not? We will type dot flower because we want to make this one sticky. And we are going to call this as position sticky. And as soon as I do this, let's go into like this page. Let's see if it works. Let's go to the live page. And it's not getting sticky. And that is because we need to add something else called top. And top is basically, I'm going to add like zero pixels right now. Okay. So the, diff, the, uh, the spacing between like top and bottom is like zero spacing. If you don't, I'll explain to you in better way. So just wait and bear with me. But basically if I keep like this, you could see it just works and then it just stops as soon as the container ends like this. And if I want to do like 50 pix, like 100 pixels of difference. Uh, maybe like let's do like 10 vh instead that is like 10 percent of this one and this is how it works so that's the difference of 10 vh from the top so if i scroll down you could see that there's like a difference of 10 vh you could also type pixel or anything whichever works for you and this is how you could just make something sticky by just adding like this much okay but again like i said if you want it to be sticky on top of here like this and even when you scroll outside this container because right now you could see that this one is actually going to be staying inside this container only so it will stop as soon as it reaches around here 
so you could see but if you want to have it something on top obviously you know there's another method which is like position sticky and you don't need css for this one so position sticky position absolute are something that is like just present in css and sticky is like new stuff that came so yeah we could actually just add absolute and fix there are actually more options and i don't know why position or why there's no option of relative and stuff in the position for elementor kind of annoying but this is like fixed you can see this is how it looks on the fixed one and it just gets sticky to everything it, you can see it does not start from uh, this part if you use position sticky and then we will actually need to like play with values until we find something that works like percentage wise something like this we will need to play around with like this one to make sure it works like this but again it does not work from here so that is like one difference but if you want to create something which is like very sim simple and sticky and for example i actually have a tutorial on how you could create like those navigation icons you know these are which are present around here like those short uh, keys floating icons basically and that one uses like fixed option and you could try that it just works nicely too but again the code is here very simple position sticky and you could just make anything sticky in that container so know the limitations that are ar uh, around here if i find something like that is a uh, updated one i'll update in like the new video i'll link it in this video too if i find something better but this is basically what we just use and it just works nicely so yeah thanks for watching like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video